Hey everybody, this is Tridang to Live, and uh, I'm going to show you guys uh, the how-to of my go-to vehicle. This is the ship that I always build, uh, either if I'm starting off on a new project or if I'm you know, doing some new things. Uh, this is my my starting vehicle. Sometimes I'll modify it, but this is a a nice simple vehicle. It'll get you into oops, don't want that part. Uh, it'll get you into orbit nice and easy. It'll get you, uh, actually it's fast enough, I believe, to get to an escape velocity, not vector velocity. Ignore my previous statements in other videos. Uh, anyways, so uh, the starting is just a very basic, uh, the command capsule, of course, and then the uh, parachute, um, a decoupler, an SAS, and then two uh, liquid tanks on a liquid engine. Uh, we'll go ahead and put another decoupler on there, put the tricoupler on there, and then we're going to put down oops, we're here, uh, a set of SASs. And then basically what these are going to do is just give us a little extra stability. These are optional. I like them just because I don't want to fighting my engine or my rocket all the way up. Uh, we're going to put three on here. You can actually get away with two, I believe. Um, it just doesn't give you as much oomph and you don't have as much... Uh, uh, fuel when you get into space. You'll still need to use some of this rocket part, uh, this final stage, to get into orbit. And this actually cannot take off on its own, so we're going to give it a little boost. We're going to put those on there, and we're going to put some solids right here. Get those all lined up, and I actually put uh, nine solids on there, so we'll get those on there nice and even. Hopefully that looks. Oh, that doesn't look that great. This one needs to come up a little higher. So we get that on there nice and good. Nice and good. One or the other is not an option. I like keeping things balanced. Makes me feel like I'll fly straight. That doesn't look balanced. No, one more time. There we go. That looks better. That'll be better. All right. And then coming to the realization that uh, this is going to hurl down on all of our friends at Mission Control. Uh, we'll put some nice little parachutes on there. So we've got a pretty good rocket. We're going to do one last thing, which is we're going to tie uh, these rockets to these rockets. So they all fire at the same time. It's just going to give us a little extra boost at the beginning there. And we just have to drag all these down so they launch at the exact same time. And so these three rockets here are on the first part. And we'll go to launch, and we'll see what's going to go, go on. Drink a little tea while we wait. Mmm. Tea. Takes a little bit for this to convert over. All right, turn the SAS on. Crank up our throttle. There we go. We're going to lean just a little bit. This is what the extra SASs help us out with. And uh, I like to try to keep it nice and straight because I don't like to use use uh, a lot of power flying everywhere. And what you'll notice is we're on uh, number six here. And then when these run out, these nine here run out, we'll trigger this, which will cause everything to drop, which will be pretty nice. And the big thing about this is we're just getting ourselves high enough so that we're not going to fall back to the atmosphere. And so we drop those off, and they're going to fall back down. And you can see the parachutes coming out, and so they'll drift back down to be reused at a later date. Not really. I don't think that's actually part of the game right now. Well, I know it's not part of the game. Hopefully it will be later. And uh, this rocket will take us right up into uh, a nice orbit, or we could take it to escape velocity or whatever. And so this is my starting rocket. And there's a, quite a few varieties and uh, things you can do. Sometimes I'll put an extra... Uh, an extra tube up here just to give myself a little bit more on my uh, on my final uh, rocket. Anyways, this one works out fine. I'm going to drop this one off early and then there we go. So there's that. Works fine. Accidentally hit my thing too many times. Oh well, that's alright. Anyways, so that's a uh, how to I never kill that always cracks me up. There's a how to of oh over right of how um to build uh 
my starting rocket. It works out really good. It's pretty stable. Um, you know, it's not crazy experimental. It works with any version because it's all stock, and it'll pretty much do whatever you need it to do. It'll you can you know uh, add to it. You can change it. You can you know put a satellite in it and tweak it a little bit, um, and it works out really well. So there it is.